The Justice Department has sparked controversy by announcing its intention to pursue the death penalty for Peyton Gendron. The 20-year-old mass shooter killed 10 black customers at a grocery store in Buffalo, New York in May 2022. Gendron was previously sentenced to life in prison without parole for state charges in New York. The federal case against him includes hate crimes and weapons violations. Critics, including Equal Justice USA's Jamila Hodge and Congresswoman Ayanna Presley, argue that seeking the death penalty would not address the racism and hatred behind the crime. Presley highlighted that President Biden campaigned on eliminating the death penalty. Attorney General Merrick Garland, who was appointed by Biden, has previously instituted a moratorium on federal executions. However, the DOJ has chosen to pursue the death penalty in this case, marking the first such instance under the Biden administration. The decision has ignited a debate over the morality and effectiveness of capital punishment, leaving many questioning the president's campaign promise.